Catholic Archbishop of Abuja, Most Reverend Ignatius K. Gama, has urged Christians to show compassion and be generous to one another. K. Gama made this known recently during his pastoral visit to St. Theresa Catholic Church, Bwari, Abuja. CTV's Nina Onyekwere reports. <laughs> It was a joyful moment for parishioners and friends of St. Teresa's Catholic Church, Buari, Abuja, as the Catholic Archbishop of Abuja, Most Reverend Ignatius Kegama, paid a pastoral visit to their parish. Before the commencement of the Holy Mass, the parish priest, Reverend Father Tom Asin, welcomed the Chief Shepherd to the parish, describing him as one of the most generous bishops in the country. As a parish priest of St. Teresa's Catholic Church, Buari, Abuja, the first parish in the Catholic Archdiocese of Abuja to happily welcome in our midst our best spiritual father, His Grace Archbishop Ignatius Ayao Kaigama. He also acknowledged the palliatives the parish received from the Archbishop in recent time. In his homily, Kaigama emphasized the need for Christians to show compassion to one another. Jesus calls you and I to become sources of transmitting God's providence and generosity to the poor, the hungry, and the needy. The little we have is not little. Sometimes we say we don't have much, we only have little. But I want to tell you that little you have is not little. It is enough to go around a few people. And if every one of us touches the lives of just a few people, I tell you, the whole world will be satisfied. He added that if Nigerians could share the little they have with one another, the world would be a better place. If sharing the little we have should be the attitude of all Nigerians, Nigeria should have nothing being the so-called poverty capital of the world. The vast difference between the rich and the poor will not exist. The basics of life will be available to all. Shelter, food, portable water, roads, electricity, education, basic health care, all this will be available to all Nigerians. After the Mass, the Archbishop laid the foundation stone for the new church grotto, Our Lady on Doer of Not. Some of the parishioners spoke to CTV. My joy knows no bound. We are so excited, very happy, because this is our first time of hosting our new Archbishop. Coupled with the fact that he even laid the foundation of our grotto on Dua of North, you know, it's a, it's a great thing. We really appreciate it. We pray that he will come very soon again. You know? On behalf of all the men in our parish, St. Teresa's Parish, Buari, uh, indeed welcome the Archbishop and also felicitate with our parish priest, Reverend Father Tom and all members of uh, the pastoral team of this parish. So it, it is a great honor and we give God all the glory. I'm so happy being our new Archbishop and the remembering St. Teresa at Buari is a very good thing to us. My Archbishop, my best spiritual father has come to visit my parish of St. Teresa at Buari. So I'm so fulfilled that I have the honor to host him Today, which I'm 17 years a priest, so it's a thing of joy and happiness, and we are just elated that God has visited us in our parish. In Abuja, Nena Onyekwere, CTV News.